welcome back to Bean Gaming. Just got done working on some videos for the new tower defense game, The House. Now we're going to come back over here, World Defenders, because there was an update. wasn't a huge update, as I kind of figured, because The House coming out probably took precedent. But either way, look over here. We have a new champion skin, and then we also have the Pumpkin Dragon. I did hear some rumors, or I did hear some people reach out to me and say the Pumpkin Dragon actually isn't very good, so maybe there's a mistake with that, or a bug, or something. I don't know, but because it's Pumpkin Gems, I'm going to go ahead and get both of these. If it was Robux, then uh, i will just go buy it in the market. But I don't mind. And so you can see that if I add those two together, what is that, 3,500? So that'll bring me down to right about 120 gems, which is still okay. Let's go ahead and do the conversion over here in our conversion. Currency conversion, currency converter machine, if you will. So we need 2,000. Keep going. Oh, no, wait a minute. I can't do that because I need the pump. Oh, my God. Oh, I completely forgot about that. I wasted all these with the... I just had enough the other day. I can't even get... I can't even get either one of these. Okay, you know what? That's okay. I'll keep grinding and get them anyway. So, no worries there. Maybe I will find it in the mark. No, I'll, I'll grind it out. I don't care. That's no worries. But, what I wanted to do, at least show you the different reapers and see if I can actually beat map 2 because that's the only map that I have not completed yet and because I don't have the pumpkin dragon I'm gonna go back to my inventory over here and pull up my golden might golden hydra and see if he's gonna be able to help me out with the money and then placing all these towers so none of these towers are actually ranked except for Calavera she has golden might on her. If you remember back from my video a couple of videos ago, then I do have that. And I don't think I have any Diablo tokens. I believe I used them all up. Let's go check. Not in the shop. What am I doing? In my inventory items. And correct, I do not. So we're kind of bare bones today. And let's see if we can end up uh, winning map two. I'll see everyone in game. Shout out to my friend Alpha Werewolf Chase and Chief 5855. Sold to be the Pumpkin Reaper, Diablo Hydra, and Ringmaster. So thank you so much for that. And I'm glad I was able to remember your shout out this time. We're going to go check out Diablo Story 2. That's the last map I need to do for my showcase. I'm going to bring it all the way back to. Well, no, okay, we'll try four. We'll try four. That way, if I win, I end up getting the, the Spartan Gold token anyway. But we're going to go ahead and vote there. Bring it on in over here light the map up like that and we're gonna of course pick normal mode and let's see everyone's coming this way so I really do want to place down my golden hydra first right there there we go and then as these enemies start coming out then golden hydra's gonna be able to take care of this track here but then I'm gonna place down looks like pumpkin reaper is gonna be able to fill up on this side so we'll see it's there's a lot of there's a lot of enemies and I'm just not so sure that we'll be able to I can't I can't fit him in there so he goes over there go ahead and reap on pumpkin reaper go ahead and, and rake them let's go ahead and get another pumpkin in over there and I don't know their stats offhand so we're just gonna kind of keep placing these guys here I will put up the stats card cards that way you can see and compare and things like that i might have made a mistake on one of them i have to go back and change that eventually but if it's just for one of them then it's actually not even that big of a deal so now we have four pumpkin reapers placed i believe there's possibly six six is that right that we can place and six come on right there there's six of them and i don't believe i can do seven Let's check it out here. We're a little bit ways away, and seven. No, I can't do seven. All right, so I want to get my Golden Hydra up to 20,000 here on tier two, because that way I'll start getting 15,000 a wave. I probably should have done that first. Looks like we're probably not going to be able to survive here, because look at all these enemies still. That's quite a bit. But Pumpkin Reaper, right out of the gate, does 1,375. So, yeah, I mean, that's not overly terrible. Now we have a little bit more range with the Grim Reaper, and he does 2,750. Of course, that's with my champion boost. So let's see if we can place him. There's one, two placements there. Let's see, can I get a 
third, I can get a third placement, I can get a fourth placement. Can I get a fifth placement? I can get a fifth placement. What about a sixth? Cannot get a sixth placement. We're just kind of lining these guys up. I think I can probably wait to get the Stone Reaper. And everyone knows the Chill Reaper is bugged on Tier 2. That doesn't mean that he's worth as much as people are trying to sell him for in the marketplace. That's ridiculous. Because it is bugged now. That is true. But at the same time, we're expecting a fix at some point. So, 22 upgraded here. 22 upgraded here. And Pumpkin Reaper's a $14,000 upgrade. 22. We can get 40. 40 is pretty good. We can get 22 here. We can get 40 here. Pumpkin Reaper. All right. There you go, pal. Now you're 4 6. So he's on T3. We're on T2 here. So is it 48? And Pumpkin is at 46. So they're very similar. I can put down the Stone Reaper now. Look at just this range is so bad. And then of course, you know, it does it does this thing here. I am actually gonna upgrade my Golden Might Hydra. That way I'm getting 30,000 after every wave. And we have one Stone Reaper. We have two Stone Reapers, three Stone Reapers, okay. Three Stone Reapers, four, there's no four. four. If I can go ahead and put the Chill Reaper down now. Do one, two, I can only, well, hang on. I can do three Chill Reapers. Interesting, he starts off with 13,000 right out of the gate. So that's actually not bad at all. Another Chill Reaper? No, I cannot do another Chill Reaper. And now these enemies are starting to overwhelm, so let me go ahead and use the cheat code here for my Chill Reapers. So see that T2, there are 240,000, so it's, you know, it, it is what it is. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just playing the game. I'm just playing the game here. And apparently not very good, because we're looking to lose here. That's, that's kind of what it's looking like right now. I can go ahead and actually place Cav... Was it Cavalera? Cavalry? Whatever. Cava... I don't know what her name is. Calavera. I can do 250. I can do 300,000. So if these guys end up getting by, she's going to do 42,000 damage right now. 375. And can I get to... Because I'm already at 500. I'm already at tier 4 over here. I actually thought that I wouldn't even be able to survive this map which is interesting. I do want to get her all the way to T5, and look at this, 171,000 damage. So now we're going to try and upgrade everyone else who's not a Chill Reaper. 95. Actually, we're going to... Well, I have a long ways to go to max out my Golden Hydra. How are we looking with these guys here? 115? Yeah, I don't, I don't know if we are going to make it. Although, yeah, she's taking care of business. That's actually pretty good. I probably should consider moving these Chill Reapers back more. But probably a good idea that I was able to actually use Golden Hydra rather than trying to get that Pumpkin Reap. That was the Pumpkin Hydra, Pumpkin Reaper, whatever. I think it was the Pumpkin Hydra because that probably is, that, that's not a very good map from, or a good tower from what I hear. So that would probably have guaranteed me a loss on this map. So we're sitting pretty right now. Let's go ahead and max out our Grim Reaper here. We have another Grim Reaper we can kind of work with. Let's get to 40. Come on. These bats, they don't give me much money. There we go. 95. So things are looking a little bit better. We're on wave 15. Oh, look. I didn't... I should... Oh, I have to upgrade Chill Reaper to T2 right over here. That way I can get that that cheat code. There we go. That looks better now. Maxed out there. Pumpkin, pumpkin, pumpkin. Pumpkin, you're maxed out, pal. 14, 37, 88. We're going to get to that 205 for sure. Eventually, these bats. These bats. I was originally thinking of using these Reaper Towers on the classic Halloween maps because those are pretty easy so far. 
but they're hanging in there. They're hanging in there for sure. 45, 65, let's get to that 115. I mean, 25,000. 25,000 damage, where did he go? Right over here. 25 is actually not bad. We might actually, unless, I don't know, we might be able to win. We might, just might be able to win this. 220. There we go. I'm interested to see what the King Reaper does. I have all of the Reapers now. And so we're not sure how long that these are going to be available or when the King Reaper is coming out, but from the looks of things, his range is probably going to be like one, the way things are going right now. But no, I hope not. I hope his range is much more. It's probably not going to be, what's the, it's probably not going to be much more than the largest, the largest range tower over here. So what do we have? We're going to have 28. We have Pumpkins at 25, Grim Reapers at 25, Stone Reapers at 28, she's at 25, and Chill would be at 25. So if he gets maybe 25 to 30, that's probably what it's going to be. Alright, looks like all of my towers are maxed out. I'm not maxing out the Chill Reaper because of you know why. We're on wave 18. These towers are coming down Reaper Row. And I have enough money now to go ahead and max out my moon staff. I hope I don't have to use it. And I'm assuming that you're probably not going to want to have all of these reapers in your loadout. But because I'm doing a showcase of them, then it's kind of interesting to see them all together. It's one big happy family. Let's see if I can get this in over here. Poke my head in there for maybe a decent screenshot. And if you didn't know already, these, what are these, these orbs? They do give your towers a boost. By how much? I'm not sure. Maybe it's a 10% boost. But if you have the Reapers, there's no you can't I mean, you can't put them over there anyway because they wouldn't reach the track. So that's kind of the downfall. And just to make sure, let's go through this one more time. Make sure that I have everyone all maxed out. Now wave 19 looks pretty rough. I don't. Am I gonna even make wave 19? I should be able to. As long as Golden Hydra helps out Cavalera here, she should be able to knock out these guys with one swipe. She's actually not doing anything because Golden Golden Might, Golden Hydra is taking care of business. Should I move her? I don't think it's going to matter. She hasn't done much. She's done 59,000, which isn't bad. I think we might just be okay, folks. Because once these enemies... Oh, the boss is already out here. Once these enemies come through the Chill Reapers with their bug DPS... Then they're gonna be toast. And then these guys. Oh, this is. This might be tough. Maybe. Maybe. Get him. Get him. Okay, she got him. Now, how much are these guys? 115. So I know that she can take care of them. And with the boss being 2.3 million. Okay, nope. They went the long way, so they're toast. That's easy right there. And yes, I think we. Yeah, oh yeah. We are just fine. Let's. You know what? Let's do this. Watch. Sell. Reaper Row. I don't, I'm not even going to move her. He's toast. He is done for. No contest. Look at this. Didn't even make it to the Chill Reaper. So the Bug Chill Reaper didn't even get his hands on, on that boss. Wow, that was interesting. Like I said, I didn't think I was going to make it. Just because of how short the range the Reapers are. The, the range of those Reapers. Let's go ahead back to the main lobby and let's try this Diablo token. Probably not going to get anything, but it's still fun to do it on camera. So let's exit out over there. Let's see what friends we run into today. And we're going to hop on over. See, there he is. The pumpkin. Pumpkin Hydra, right? And then there's the champion over there. So I've already clammed those rewards today. Let's go ahead and get there the fast way. And clam right over here. The playtime gifts. Check this out. One Diablo token, please. And we're going to go ahead and spin. And what are we going to get? Anything good? Oh, here we get the throne again. The throne of doom. The throne is not very good. Well, no, I shouldn't say the throne is good. It's just I have so many of them. I'll basically give them away for free if you like. So 1,500 pumpkin gems. I need to get those from the classic maps. And I'm going to have to start grinding for those. I have enough, I have enough gems to get them. I just need these pumpkins over here. 
in order to convert to these pumpkin gems. Otherwise, I'm going to have to wait for my daily rewards. Where are they on the calendar here? What's the next one? My next one is, uh, yeah, okay, so that's good. That's good. Or I can kind of wait, and I still have some ways to go. So if I want to get it quick, I'm going to have to grind. If I'm okay with waiting, then you can see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. It's about 10 days, 11 days out for me to keep getting these over and over again. But anyway, if you did enjoy this video, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on that notification bell. Thanks again for watching, everyone. Hope you have a great day, and see you soon. Bye.